Welcome to State of Tech, this is James here with another iPad Air tip for you. I'm going to show you how to change your ringtone and even get new ringtones from iTunes. So we're going to tap on the settings down here. Now on the settings we'll come over here on the left hand side to sounds and now we have our sounds options over here on the right hand side of the screen. So you see here we can adjust our ringtone alert sounds with this slider right here. If we'd like to uh, raise it up, go ahead and slide it over to the right. To lower it, slide it over to the left. We can also change the sound with the buttons on the side of the iPad. So if we were to click the volume minus or plus on the right hand side of the iPad, we can change the volume that way as well. Now here in the sounds menu, you see we have sounds for everything that functions on the iPad. We have ringtone, text, mail, tweets, Facebook, calendar, reminders, and even airdrop sounds. And down here at the bottom, we have lock and keyboard clicks. Now, if we want to, we can go and tap on ringtone and it's going to give us all of the ringtones that are on our device and we can go ahead and choose from one. You see currently we have the opening, which is default. It's selected represented by the blue check mark. But if I were to tap on another one, say this illuminate, it gives me a preview of the ringtone and it also changes it to the blue check mark. Let me know that's the currently selected ringtone. Now this process is the same for every other uh, basic function. Text tones have different sounds, so they have alert tones instead of ringtones, but I can also use ringtones as alert tones and vice versa. So when I, when I was in the ringtone, I could actually use, if I scroll down enough, an alert tone for my text and a ringtone. Now, if I like to buy new ringtones, you see up here when I'm trying to select a sound, I have a store link in the top right hand corner. If I tap on that store, it's going to load up the iTunes store and bring me to the tones section where I can actually view and purchase new ringtones and alert tones. Sometimes they have different categories, being that it was just Halloween, there are some Halloween category. You see, we've got some TV shows, even some different artists in here. And if I were to tap on one of them, let's just say we were to tap on this Michael Buble one, we'll tap on that. And it's going to show me all of the ringtones I have available. And it works just like the iTunes store. I can tap on one, it's going to give me a preview of it. And then I can go ahead and purchase it for $129 here in the iTunes store. So that is how you're going to change your ring and alert tones on the iPad. For more iPad Air tips, be sure and visit stateoftech.net.